9% and gives us back, I think, 3% in programming unless that's changed. Uh, we do have a new television channel. Um, I'm told that it's not terribly heavily subscribed. Scotty, how many cells would be full? Well, we could always build maybe concentration camps for the people who are um, letting us down and breaking the law. So go in a bit heavier and say, you're not social distancing in the camp with you. You know, but would they social distance in the camp? The only thing is, if it's in the camp, there's a chance of contain containing the virus. Scotty, uh, I don't know who that is, so there we go. There we go. Uh, yes, how many cells would be full? Yes, I think you can always build more prisons, uh, you know, if people can't behave. You know, and there's also a bit of a kind of cheeking up um, from people as well, thinking, oh, I'm not being any of that. Ridiculous nonsense, you see. We don't want that. You could have, you've got lots of rivers around. You could have prison ships and put people that won't isolate, isolate them uh, on there. So they are, good evening, says Jamma. Good evening, Jamma. Nice to have you with us in Dinky Do. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I see. Thank you to everybody who has tapped the dollar. There we are. I'm just going to carry on sharing, guys, and you can do the same. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you've just joined us and you're wondering what on earth is going on, you're watching Scotty McClue, the first lord of the internet, the world's top broadcaster, and the world's most humble man. Here we are live, and we are discussing what to do with people who can't behave, who won't isolate when they've been told. That's what I say, yes. Right. I'm just going to... Guys, if any of you have a Reddit account, go on and follow Scotty underscore McClue. Right? If you've got a Reddit account, get on and follow Scotty underscore McClue. Get yourself on there. Big style, right? I'll pop that up. People will always rebel, but pride comes before a fall. Absolutely, Glenn. I don't think another lockdown would be the answer as the likelihood it would just be a repeat of what we've been through. So there we go. John Jones. Yes, thank you, John. Exit stuff. I could do my show from a ship. You're quite right. So there we are, but I'll take that one down. Uh, there we are, we're not mentioned the famous people. Famous people. Excellent. So there you are. So get yourselves on to Scotty underscore McClue on Reddit. Yes, and you'll see me on there. That would be fantastic. There's always something new happening with Scotty McClue. Wonderful stuff. What else have we got here? Yes. Agreed, Scotty, says Kareem. Thank you, Kareem. So there we go. So, Frank, where did you get this enough of the independence talk? You know, Scotty, you could rally the troops. I think so, Glenn Peacock, because we tell the truth on here. That's what it's all about. We tell the truth. I mean, all this nonsense that's being made about the people coming in on the rubber dinghies, we have, I think it's less than 1% of our quota. So there we go. Very, very interesting. But what's happening, there's certain people playing on folks' xenophobia. Same with Brexit. That was xenophobia. Think sooner rather than later people will panic buy. Now, Frank, why would they panic buy if there's no panic? During lockdown, the numbers decrease, obviously. But as it eases, there's always going to be spikes till we find a proper vaccine. Yes, or until it dies out. You know, because really the problem is, and the problem with finding a vaccine, we don't really know what we're dealing with. That's what's happening. We don't know what we're dealing with. Yes. Right. I'm just going to do another little bit of sharing. 
Okay, okay. Na, 